No, it's not the voice of God speaking to you from a soon-to-be burning bush. But it might be the cries of an innocent child about to be burnt in the flames of hell because he or she has just found one of these. Serious Christian News. The first thing that people need to realize is that Easter eggs are not good for us. They make us gain weight. They rot our teeth. They raise our insulin levels. I mean, if you're a diabetic, an Easter egg can kill you. Now, nowhere in the scriptures does it say that God sought to destroy the diabetics. Why did Satan create the Easter egg? Well, he created it so that he could distract serious Christians from the true meaning of Easter. I mean, that's why the egg is shiny. Yeah. I mean, if you're scrounging around in your garden looking for a shiny egg, I can tell you this much, you're certainly not thinking of a man nailed to a wooden cross bleeding to death. Now, that's what children should be thinking about. Satan's master Easter egg plan, however, is much more sinister and of great concern to all humankind. The Serious Christian Network has in its possession verbal evidence that Satan's concubines, Satan's followers, are gathering the leftover bits of Easter egg tinfoil. And with it, they plan to construct a giant satellite dish, which they intend to aim at the Earth's crust, harnessing the sun's rays and burning a hole straight down to hell. Now, of course, this will unleash the ram of destruction himself and uh, all of his demons, all of his gargoyles and whatnot. It will also release some very bad smells. Sulfur. Eggy smells. Now, I don't think that's a coincidence. The good news, though, is that serious Christians all around the world have a way to celebrate Easter without satanic Easter eggs. And that is to put themselves through the gut-wrenching trauma that the Almighty One endured by crucifying the one he loved most. So as a serious Christian family, we've decided to crucify my daughter's favorite doll. She absolutely adores it, which means that it's perfect. We also got to hide some rusty nails in the garden for the kids. Don't be fooled, serious Christians. Look away from the shiny egg and keep your focus on the path of righteousness that lies before you. If you don't, Every step you take will be another step closer to the end of the world.